everyone, Willow Wildmoon here. Today I am subbing for your Tuesday regular host, Pandora. This week on Starting Out Solitary, we are talking about pagan funerals and how you would like to be taken care of. Now for me personally, this is not a topic that comes up quite too often in a conversation. And generally speaking, if it does so, it is prompted by hearing of someone's passing or the need to attend a funeral. It also depends on who I'm having the conversation with. So, for example, if I'm talking to my mum about it, she finds it quite difficult and emotional to, to even imagine having to bury either of her children before her time. And I completely and totally understand that. However, if I'm having the conversation with hubby or friends, I feel I can be more open and talk about it in greater length and share and share ways that I wish to be honored and celebrated for having my time here on earth. For most parts, pagan funerals are not singularly defiable because there are so many different beliefs. Um, you know, there are different pagans who believe different and practice differently, etc. But generally speaking, pagans are either buried or cremated. And if they are cremated, then most likely the ashes will be scattered somewhere of a special significant importance to them, to the individual or a sacred place rather than having a loved one keep the ashes. For me personally, over time, the way I wish to have my funeral has changed. Way back when there was a time where I didn't care, you know, I was no longer on earth and, you know, at minimal cost, it didn't bother me, whatever. Then I really liked the idea, um, then the idea of being cremated really called to me because I like the idea of having my ashes scattered somewhere that was special to me rather than being in a, in a fixed place. However, in the last few years that's changed and I really love the idea of having a green funeral or a green burial where in comparison to your traditional or your standard funeral, having a green funeral or burial is environmentally a more environmentally conscious, environmentally friendly. Here in Australia, you cannot le you're legally prohibited from being buried without some sort of cover. So therefore, I love the idea of having an eco-friendly casket or a shroud. And both are, are beautiful and unique in their own individual ways and I can't, I can't quite decide uh, on that one. I love the idea of having a ritual performed by a, either a high priest or a high priestess where the deities are called in and ancestors are called in and the watchtowers and elements are also called in. I love the idea of having incense burning. I love the idea of having a mourning altar where items of that are significant to me and that represent me and the life that I had are placed on that altar. I also love the idea of having a main altar altar candle that also serves as a purpose for honoring you know each year but also giving the opportunity for those dearest and near to me um, the chance to light the candle should they feel called to you know during that time as well i love the idea of handing out a a soul candle i guess where you know that can be lit as well um you know at my funeral and taken home and then um you know lit whenever the person is called to, you know, or feeling drawn to, to light as well. For a tombstone, I like to keep that natural as well. So either a, you know, like a little boulder of some sort or a stone, an engraved stone, or either a tree planted. I love the idea of having a tree and perhaps even a willow, a willow tree. Um, as far as clothing, I want simple, minimal, biodegradable, biodegradable clothing and makeup um, you know to be not tested on animals and and vegan preferred and if that's not an option then no makeup is fine for me as well no chemicals to be sprayed because that's a thing as well I looked into that there are uh, in your standard traditional funerals there are a lot of chemicals that are sprayed as well yeah so very eco-friendly um, is how I wish to have my funeral as well. And music, oh, I love music. I want lots of music to be played. I think that about, that about covers it. 
um, yeah so I would also like to hear you know ideas of ways that you wish to be taken care of so you know any funeral ideas um, that you have so please put them down in the comments below until my next video sending you so much love